girl. Baby 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 girl. Yeah, we got a lot to do, y'all, but we also got a lot done. And yesterday was just crazy. But well, let me update y'all. So I am obviously very close to my employees. This is my core team. Anybody that works for me has also become somebody I love and a friend in some way. And it's very hard to separate both, but it must happen as a boss, as a CEO. We had a huge team meeting. You know, the girls are always at my house. And the meeting was just about them separating, hanging out, and business. Because before I let my company go to shit, I will let you go, I will fire you, and be your friend if you cannot manage both. And, and which it's not gonna get to that point. I know Be Simone Beauty is only seven months in. Seventh month, it's our seventh month. Actually, our anniversary was yesterday. Seven month anniversary, we had a, a meeting of us getting in the ass. But the girls that work for our company are so driven, so hungry, so loyal, so eager to learn. But what, what I'm trying to implement is being a forward thinker. For every up, there's a down. For every left, there's a right. For every in, there's an out. For every black, there's a white. For every problem, there's a what? Solution. That's it. For every problem, there is a solution. What is the fucking solution? If you call me and say, oh my gosh, we're out of trash bags at the store. Okay. That's not gonna work for me. I need my employees, the people that work for me, the people that are around me, to make phone calls like this. Hey, we're out of trash bags at the store. I'm gonna be out of the office for about 10 minutes. I'm on my way to Walmart to get some. That is the type of people I need around me. A, hey, the computer's out of ink, but guess what? I know we're gonna need ink, so I restocked stocked on ink, so let me go down to storage and grab some ink real quick. A, hey, the computer's out of ink. I need your card number so I can buy more ink. Not, A, the computer's out of ink. We haven't printed orders in an hour. That is not going to work. What is the solution? So just trying to get my team. We're, we're such a new team. Six months. I was Googling and researching Amazon yesterday because Amani used to work at Amazon. So we were talking about the machine. First of all, Amazon was founded in 1994. They're almost 30 years ahead of us. We're in our seventh month. They're on their 26th year. And the way Amazon moves in the story and I was researching and looking at the warehouse they have almost a two million square foot warehouse you can't even walk from one end to the other end without walking miles it's unbelievable they have robots they have machines everything is a machine everything knows its proper place and for us to get to a point like that for be Simone Beauty to be an Amazon or be a one-stop shop for beauty gurus or a one-stop shop for everything beautiful by B. Simone we have to start thinking like an Amazon, even though we are only seven months in. We have to start thinking and moving like a billion dollar company if that's the direction we're trying to go in. So we had a team meeting, it went great. And I'm just excited to move forward with my employees and 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 move forward with Be Simone Beauty. It's unbelievable, it's unbelievable how God works because just two months ago, I was hustling to be a millionaire. Hustling, hustling, hustling to be a millionaire by the time I was 30. Today is April 16th. We're only halfway into the month of April. Be Simone Beauty. Let me show you how much we made this month. This is how much Be Simone Beauty made in the month of April. And I'm not, I'm not going to keep showing y'all my accounts, keep showing y'all every number. I actually don't know if I'm going to or not, because I'm not doing it, as y'all can see. I'm not doing it for the bragging rights. I don't give a 
about money i still got the same shit on my hair look crazy i'm doing it to show y'all what obedience hard work dedication a team i'm trying to show y'all the journey i can only show y'all my truth this is mind-blowing to me in 16 days be simone beauty made this amount of money i don't know i don't know if it's right or wrong to show y'all to show y'all my numbers but I feel like it's right in my heart because I know my intentions are it's not to brag, not to boast, not to be prideful, not to be arrogant, not to have an ego. My intentions are to show you the journey and show you if I can do it, you can do it. And y'all have been on this journey with me five years ago when I was on the floor. Five years ago when I was waitressing, crying on Snapchat. Five years ago when I was struggling, telling y'all my story, making ranting videos. If I could show y'all the bad, why not show y'all the good? Why not show y'all the light at the end of the tunnel? So I I'm still floored by these numbers. And, and let me tell you, in November, my goal was to have a $100,000 month. And I reached that goal the last day of November, crying. If you go back to Baby Girl TV and go back um, on my Instagram, all the proof is right there. I document everything. Back in November, my goal was to have a $100,000 month for Be Simone Beauty. This month so far, we're at $500,000 in 16 days. God's will, if it's God's will, who knows? We might have a million dollar month. We might have a million dollar month. I'm mind blown. I'm grateful. I'm hungry. I'm grinding. I'm working. And I want any entrepreneurs, any, any young CEOs, any young black women, build you a team and be hard on their ass. But guess what? You have to be a leader if you want your team to step it up. Don't be no lazy CEO. Don't be, hey, y'all, go do the orders. I'm out partying. Hey, y'all, go do the orders. I'm out having brunch, having mimosas. I don't have, first of all, I don't have to do anything. I don't have to be at the office. That's what I pay employees for. If we don't have enough hands, I can go hire somebody else. But I don't want that. That's not who I am. I am a, I want to be hands-on with everything I do. I'm too hands-on. It gives me too much anxiety knowing the orders aren't shipped out and I'm at the home to I'm at home taking a nap. It gives me anxiety knowing the orders aren't shipped out and I'm working out. And working out is is something positive. It gives me anxiety knowing orders aren't shipped out and I'm, re I'm resting, I'm sleeping at night and I have to sleep. So I want y'all to know as a CEO, as an entrepreneur, you have got to lead your team. When they leave, we, we've been working 15 hour shifts. I'm right there with them. They walking out, out the office at 1 a.m., I'm walking out at 1 a.m. with them. They, they, and the only reason I'm not gone now is because I'm working. I'm making a YouTube video for y'all. Showing y'all my journey or else I'd be in that U-Haul driving to the post office right now. I got, I got a Zoom meeting at 11 o'clock, so I got to go in a minute. But as a CEO, as a leader, as a leader, I'm going to finish this statement and go to another one. But um, as a CEO, as a leader, as an entrepreneur, you have to lead your team. Ain't nobody going to step it up if you're a lazy, a lazy CEO. You don't care about the company. Why the f*** am I going to care about it? You don't work hard. Why am I going to work hard? You don't give a damn about Be Simone Beauty. Why would I care about it? It ain't my business. No. No. Be Simone Beauty will be a billion dollar company. Easily. I'm speaking it. I'm believing it. I know it in my heart. And we, we in the baby stages right now. We have this small workspace. I'm so grateful my manager lets us work out of there. You know, Cupcake Mafia is at the bottom, it's shipping at the top. It's very small, but we're grateful for that space. We tripping over each other, falling over each other, an organization. But when we get that building, oh my God, 20,000 square foot building or more, because it's going to allow us to expand so much pray for us all my prayer warriors out there pray we get the best building for what we're trying to do in atlanta we want to have a storefront we want to have the products there um we have a lot of plans for that and um i'm just excited i'm excited i want to share that with y'all let y'all know that we do have trials and tribulations too 
We've been frazzled. A lot of people have not gotten their orders from April 5th and it's simply because we had a glitch in the system. You fix it. You, find, you have issues, you find a solution, you fix it and you move forward as a team. I'm proud of my team. I love my team. Um, I'm proud of us. I'm proud of myself. I love my manager. You know, Skittles has been a huge help and we're just gonna keep moving. So today, I'm about to take this U-Haul to the post office and get all these orders out. We got about 3,000 lip gloss orders. Y'all wish me luck, cause I be whipping this U-Haul like, I know what I'm doing and I don't. I done it. Last time I hit a truck, I was like, sorry. Thankfully, he didn't give a damn. And he let me keep going, but I was like, Shit, I didn't get the insurance. So yeah, once again, for motivational purposes only, Everything I share with you guys, everything I talk about, every every dollar, every whatever. And just as much as I'm sharing it with you, I'm mind blown also. I'm excited. I'm, I'm grateful. I'm humbled. And I, I know that with obedience, with faith, with a good team, with hard work and dedication, with a plan and execution, with manifestation, come on, the way you speak, the way you think, anything is possible anything is possible i was grinding to be a millionaire by the time i'm 30 and now be simone beauty can potentially have a million dollar month keep working y'all i love y'all and yeah lastly like i said i don't want to make everything about money it's not about money it's about speaking things reaching your goals getting past those trials and tribulations it's not about money i want y'all to get that in your head the money will come money has never been my driving force for anything money has never motivated me to do anything my passion and my purpose always motivates me i know the money's gonna come i know financial stability is gonna come and that's gonna happen i'm not worried about that what i'm focused on is walking in my purpose and letting the will of god be done in my life everything else will fall into place so don't make your drive and everything about money. Money is going to come. Don't stress about money. You'll be fine. Focus on everything else and the money and the success and everything will fall into place. So I love you guys.